They'll be calling you a radical. This is really important video because it's video number 2011. Lots of interviews I said that's where I'll end it, at 2011. You know, I don't know. So, just major, major news and hang in with me and the fanny goats. Fuck this country. Fuck this populace. Fuck this self and Fuck every one of these pigs. You know, we got a small fucking group that give a fuck the 350 million pigs that live in this country, and that's what they are. They're self-indulged, grotesque fucking pigs. Fuck them. Really, fuck them. I've come to that conclusion. I don't give a fuck what people think. I don't care what people say. Look, they're fucking not going out. Oh, Bernie's going to say, climate change, climate, in 100 years this will happen. In 50 years it'll happen. Fuck you, Bernie. It's happening right here, right now, and you know what's happening. Oh, then you got the Trumper fucking freak show. Oh, fuck yeah. It's all God's will. Fucking asshole told me yesterday. Oh, it'll probably be good they cold Pacific Ocean for a year of the fishing. It'll come. Hello, it ain't coming back. The greatest ecological content. The greatest event in fucking human history. The greatest event. It happened. 311. So, there's going to be a lot of whistleblower information in this, and all we can do now is record this for history. So, my two little five-year-old grandsons I'm going to pick up right now, you know, my little boys who were born just days after Fukushima, you know, this is their toys. Yeah, he was made from plutonium. So they can look back and say, boy, did my grandpa try. Boy, did my grandpa, you know, this is a compelling, amazing story, you know. Remember, you know, I got leukemia shortly thereafter. My little boys were born right thereafter. I've never fought so hard, and, we're, and I'm a hard fucking worker. I've done a lot of things with my life. I've never fought so hard and been fucking kicked down and spit on so fucking hard in my fucking life. You know, what? look, my native intuitive fucking soul knows what this is. This self-indulged, I, look, first, I'll get to the information. Oregon's going to completely close, and the state of Washington and California going to completely close all salmon fishing. That's what Saborine said. They're going to meet again on the 15th of April, then the recommendation goes into the feds on the 1st. They bet they know it's in fucking total collapse, total collapse, they know it, but there's a lot of pressure on them. Fairy tale fucking fishermen come fish because the, the, the fishing industry, they don't care if they catch any fish, they still need them to show up. That's what we do in this fucking country, lies, we genocide. And fuck you, they, you know, hundreds of fucking dead, at the exact simultaneously time, simultaneous. The fucking total collapse of the Pacific Ocean. Total collapse. I said that day, the Great Pacific Genocide. You know, Paul Stegner. If you think the Germans invented genocide, you know nothing about the American West. I will quote Russell Means. Like I said, the natives, their creation stories, they predicted all this. They predicted the red sun. They predicted the fucking heat source off fucking messing with the fucking atom. They predicted it all. You fucking devils come from fucking Europe. You fucking mass murder and evil fucking devils come to this place. And your so-called Christianity. You're looking for fucking heaven. You want to do anything? Preaching us to telling us how you get to fucking heaven. Searching for fucking heaven. Before you got here, we had heaven. We had no jails. We had no locks. We had no disease. This is the grotesquest, evilest nation fucking of people in the history of humankind from the day the first fucking devil set foot here. This goes on all day. We built statues of the fucking mass murder, genocidal fucking murdering maniacs. Remember, we have a Columbus Day. Paddling canoe through the pass. When DeSoto come here, let's name a car company after DeSoto. He tricked them. They come across here, they disease, they mass murder, they fucking slaughter. Every fucking living, look what they did to the buffalo. You know, right here, you've seen the movie, that's based right here, the fort right here, Jedediah Smith, fucking Jim Bridger, those fucking mass murder and fucking, you know, the French fur fucking traders, we worship them, we name mountains after them, we name buildings after them. They slaughter, they fucking mass murder. They come across, Stanford kills you. You ever slept in the fucking Redwoods? You ever slept with the Sequoias? Now think about this. 
These fuckers just take them down. Stafford is married fucking mass murder man. Cut them all down. They're the only place on earth they exist. They cut fucking almost all of them down. Now think about that. How could you slip in? If you got any kind of intuitive soul, any kind of fuck, how, how could you do that? We've created a culture in this country that wants to kill us. Oh, you fucking, <laughs> you environment. <laughs> fuck you. Oh, when they talk to me like that, I fight them. I physically will fight these pieces of shit. They say, oh, they'll wake up when they get, no, they won't. When they get cancer and die, it's too fucking late because there's that self-indulge. I equate it a lot to Harriet Beecher Stowe's great work. When, daddy, how can you do this in the name of Christianity? You're a fucking liar. You're a liar. How can you do this? Take the babies out of thing. Oh, we're doing the right thing. Remember, the whole country went along with it. The whole country. When they're slaughtering the buffalo fucking just for fucking sport. Fuck, right here. Kill the biggest fucking mule deer on earth. He come up and he, I watched him grow up. Here, let this fucking old freak from Idaho come and kill him so he can fucking mount his head on the fucking wall. Think about it. There's a commercial running on the NCAA slave fucking tournament right now. And you will look it up. And so this guy's talking about the sea turtles giving birth and everybody's falling down. A culture. But yeah, you want to talk about fucking some fuck, I mean, wow. Wow. What a sickening, disgusting, grotesque, and the Californians are the worst. Well, I shouldn't say that. I mean, I guess they're no worse than they're not from California. They're slaughtered. So why wouldn't they go for the Pacific Ocean? So they're still saying, warm current. Warm currents don't fucking slaughter the entire fuck. This is the greatest event in fucking human history. The heat source coming off Fukushima, Japan, think about it. The three robots they sent in can handle fucking temperatures of up to fucking 15,000 degrees Fahrenheit. 15,000 degrees Fahrenheit. They melt. They get a new one that can handle 22,000. It melts. What's he Oh, it's fuck climate change. In 50 years, the water's going to rise and fucking flood our land. Erosion. Fuck you. Not going to happen. Could have happened. This is the most sickening generation of human beings. I told the greatest fucking story in fucking history. I fought my ass off trying. I'm like, hello. Yo, what can we do, bro? Fuck right on, bro. What's he talking about, bro? Fuck it. Just fuck it. That fucking guy asked me the other day. He says, oh, a guy been fishing? I says, fuck. I'm the guy that started all these fucking people out. Just enjoy it, bro. What a self-indulged, selfish piece of fucking shit. All of them. The brain biology. Fucking glass houses don't give a fuck in their own personal fucking pyramid. It's fucking sickening. The whole fucking ocean's in total fucking collapse. And it's the greatest fucking event in it's Fukushima. The heat source off of there is just fucking annihilate. Oh, okay, okay, well, the plankton's god, the tide pools. I've been fucking screaming my head off from the fucking day it happened. You know, right down to my own fucking leukemia and fucking thing. Watch my fight. Watch me survive. Watch me fight for my grandchildren. Watch me fight for the animals. Watch me fight for the sea. But you don't give a fuck. Look. Look. I want everybody that fucking out there. There's a small teeny group of us that give a fuck. But we're one in a million. Literally one in a million. Do the math. This is fucking so sad. This is the greatest event in human fucking history. You know. Also, I'll talk a little bit about the Reagan case. Whistleblowers, I got a lot of whistleblowers. I have the whole fucking time they come to me. The reason the, the Reagan case hasn't gone forward, they pull Patriot Act, they pull Patriot Act. Bernie Sanders fucking people right to my face. I'm like, Bernie went crazy fucking year after fucking Fukushima. Why wouldn't he not talk? Why? They didn't know what Fukushima was. So, they've been told to fucking stand down. All of them. They're not allowed to mention. Now think about that. So they do it. I wish somebody would tell me, Kevin, you can't talk about these guys. Fuck you! Kill me. Put me in fucking prison for life. You know, the greatest fucking collapse. Wow. Wow. Remember, we, Stanford, there's university after him, this fucking cabal of evil self indulgence Oh, it's just all of them. It's all them. It's this pyramid, this control. We have no other thing. It's fucking this fucking one family rules the world and just control. It's fucking aliens. It's Illuminati. It's chemtrails. It's fucking, you know, low frequency fucking elf. The no, fuck it is. It's you. It's you. You self indulged pigs. That's what you are. The whole country self indulged grotesque pigs. I don't give a fuck what you say about me because I'll tell you what. I'll record this in history. You know, I'll record it in history. 
and it will be viewed in history. I said this the day it happened. The day it fucking happened. Arnie Gundershield, oh, Kev, it's just a hydrobystone. Yo, Chris Busby, oh, it'll loot. Helen Cavicott, don't use the F word. Ha! False equivalency, they're the fucking problem. Well, A to Z. You know, fought my fucking ass off, fucking thing for what? You know, my own cancer, all in. Thank you to the fucking group of people that have supported me. You know, thank you. I mean, without you, we wouldn't have done this. And, you know, I've gone broke. You know that. You know, my bill was $1.8 million. All in on this. I want to keep fighting. You know, I need a partner. You know I need a partner. I've been begging for a partner the whole time. Somebody with some fucking money. Somebody, I mean, I got to have it. You know, I want to go back to San Diego and report the Reagan case if it ever does fucking go forward day by day. I want to keep fighting for the fucking scene, record for my grandchildren, report for the fucking future, and so people can say, hey, look at this. Wow. These contemporary fuck, these marine biologists, fucking all, they all need to be fucking, oh, fuck yeah, they all need to be rounded up. They've recorded themselves in history. Like I said, I'm a peace activist. I don't believe in violence. They slaughtered the fucking, what they did to the natives, fucking, especially in California. Oh my God, Oregon, Washington, the coast, all of them. Let's build a university. Let's build fucking monuments to these slaughters. So my guess is if we continue that path, the first thing we'll, up along the ocean, we'll build opalasses all along the fucking coast of California. And we'll name them after marine biologists. We'll name them after Barack Obama, Barry Antoinette, Gina McCarthy, fucking Hillary fucking Clinton, David fucking Vitter, the fucking Mitch McConnell, fucking we'll have Opalus in there, uh, Jay Collin, fucking Ken Buesler, fucking Helen Caldecott, we'll name Opalus, all these people that, the, you know, Kyle Berkeley, the marine biologists there, we'll fucking all the scientists there, the whole cover up, and we'll name monuments after them, because that's what we do. The mirror's all fucking dead, starving to death. You know, it took me a year and a half to even convince anybody it was one fucker. I was the only fucker on earth screaming this is full blown up. I was the only fucker on earth. All in every day. The only fucking person on earth. You'd think, you'd think somebody would come to me. Say, Kev, hell, let's do this. No, fuck, with a $40 fucking YouTube camera and a $10 fucking tripod. And, you know, my soul and my fight, my path. Fucking, you, you think about what I've done. What we've done. Our teeny, teeny, I mean... The small group that has sponsored me, I, I can't say how much you mean to me and how much I love you and how important it's been. You know, I'll go down with the ship? Oh, yeah. I'm going to go down with the fucking ship. You know, Ackerman and a bunch of different people I talked to, him, I, I told them a long time, look, you walked the fucking plank. I walked this plank a long time ago. I'm glad I fucking did. And they all, this 300 fucking people got a gun at the back of my fucking head. So I, I dove in, and I'll fucking keep swimming and... I'll die that way. I'll go. I'll die this way. I know that. I know that. But you know, like some of those natives before. You know, I earned my red feather. You know, that's what I was supposed to do. Let I me mean, tell you, I, I fucking. I don't know. Heartbroken. I'm more than fucking heartbroken. This society is so fucking grotesque. It's worse than fucking. The Columbus fucking creeps. It's worse than fucking the Harriet Beecher Stowe fucking, you know, fake fucking Christian creeps. Oh, it's all God's will. It's all God's will because you will take no fucking personal responsibility. <coughs> it's the Illuminati. It's no personal responsibility. self indulge bunch of fucking pigs. You fuckers in Oregon. Fishing industry. Go drive a truck. Eat your fucking hammer. Go around your contemporary because you got nothing. You got no sex. You got no fucking love. You got no fucking cerebral cortex. You got no art. You got no path. You got no gain. Your facade. You got shit. So why not just fucking die and ride off it? Go eat your fucking oxys. Your fucking pills. And go on your contemporary thing. And fucking think you're all that. Because it's all mental masturbation because you got no sex. You got no love. You got no fucking courage. You got no... Johnny got his gun. It's all fucking God's... Will. No, it's not, Tim Shell. No, it's not. Because every fucking one of you, every one of you, I'm a big believer in the hereafter, the native stories. Every single one of you, your soul's going to be sucked into a black hole. Will you come back as an anemia or a fucking worm on a hook? Oh, much worse than that. Much, And I don't give a fuck what anybody thinks of me. I tried... And I thought my ass, number 2011 fucking videos, the fucking greatest fucking event in fucking history. 3-11-11. Went into the bone marrow transplant center on 11-11-11. Wow. Where do we go from here? I know what I'm doing. I'll just fight to the day I fucking die. 
That's the way my soul take its place and my little grandchildren are when they grow up to be men. And they're gonna look back and say, my grandpa was a man, my grandpa fucking stood up. The rest of these self-indulged fucking creeps. And they're gonna look back and they'll fucking carry my body to the fucking grave and wrap me up and put me in the fucking hole. And they'll say, I can only hope to fight and defend like he did for mine. You know, you fucking pigs make me fucking sick. Fucking sick. Fucking ocean dying. Fuck all. It's just warm ocean. Fucking self-indulged, grotesquest population. I mean, marine biologists all fucking glass house. Fucking disgusting pigs. Fuck you, every fucking one of you. Stay in tune it.